Guys, this is a quick little video to give you another piece of information on the APTA Old Fart. And to correct something I said in the prior video, um, everything you saw in that video was correct. But on, in two places in it, I misspoke when I said that the single 16 gram cartridge was inflating the APTA to 230 pounds. That's not true. Um, what you were looking at was 165 PSI in the chamber, um, both for the tree shot and for the vertical shot pulling up the throw line. That 165 PSI pulled 131 feet of throw line on a straight vertical shot. Once I realized my error, it dawned on me that there might be a sweet spot, that we had some room to maneuver, and there might be a sweet spot between the length of the tree stuff barrel, the weight of the 12 ounce weaver bag, and the size, the volume of the pressure chamber that I would choose. So back to Home Depot, and I came back with a three foot pipe instead of a four foot pipe, 36 uh, inches by one inch. I'm still in steel here, I've spared every expense. Uh, the, um, the silver appearance is uh, Galvi. And it turns out that now the 16 gram cartridge will pressurize this to 210 PSI and the pull out of the throw line uh, bucket will be over 150 feet. So that's what I'd like to show you here. Um, we're going to, I've loaded the bag. Uh, I'm screwing in the uh, adapter into the Schrader valve. And I've got the valve open now, so you know there's only one charge in there. The valve is closed, and we're going to put in a 16, a 16 gram CO2 cartridge. And um, I've learned that it pays to wait about a minute after you've squirted in the cartridge. Uh, the gas, of course, gets cold. And uh, you'll get a better shot if you give it a minute to, um, to warm up again. Um, the new pressure chamber here has earned the appreciative comment of my neighbor's eight-year-old son. Um, his comment was, wow. And he said, that was way higher than any of the trees we have. <laughs> and he's absolutely right. Boy's got a future here. So. Um, Keep an eye on the, um, on the uh, bucket, and you'll get some sense of the hang time here. And, uh, and then uh, I'll measure it later and uh, post it at the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Okay. I'll tie off this this length and straighten out the throw line and post the measurement. That wasn't a great shot. You could see a tangle being pulled up out of the bucket. Because it straightened itself out on its own, I thought I should report the results as they happened, but the flight of the bag was not smooth because of the way it paid out of the bucket.